Hello Divine Feminine and welcome to your power message for Thursday and if you're loving this wig girls I'm going to be talking about this wig at the end of the reading. So the message today is about new beginnings, fresh starts and seeing today as an opportunity to really begin again, love your life and feel good. It says each day is a new opportunity. I choose to make this day a great one. Thank you universe, I am ready for all the magic that you have to give to me. Today is a beautiful day. And it's so true. This could be the day that you come into your union. This could be the day that you connect with your twin flame. This could be the day when you receive that message or that job offer or something magical takes place that blows you away. Anything is possible on this journey, so wake up in gratitude. And even if it doesn't happen today or tomorrow, it's going to come in on one of these days. And the more happy you are, the more loving life you are, the more in the energy of power you are, the quicker it's going to come in. So say to the universe today, I am ready. I am ready for what you have for me and I feel free. And sometimes to feel that way, we have to embrace our inner goddess. So I'm going to bring in love your inner goddess today. I'm going to use this later as well in the daily twin flame reading. So I'm going to use this deck to bring in a message. And we've got this gorgeous hat and this book and these daisies on the calendar. And, you know, the hat is also about protection and shielding yourself from any negativity or any fear or anyone trying to drag you down. The book is about the wisdom that you are, you know, receiving and all the knowledge you are gathering from the squirrel energy too. I've been seeing squirrels everywhere. The cup is about the cup of life. And I'm really seeing this as being in the energy of the cups right now in the tarot. You know, I'm doing the Learn Tarot series. We're doing the cups right now. And the cups are about power and overcoming boredom or struggle. And it's really interesting because, you know, I'm doing the four of cups today. And that energy, the gift, the block in my throat chakra, you know, when we're in that communication breakdown or that nothing's happening or we're feeling a bit lost, we can start doubting and we can start going into fear. And that's really what the Four of Cups is. You know, when we're feeling bored, frustrated, we're getting angry, but we can never be bored on this journey. There's always something good to do or something to learn or something to understand. And that gives us power. So it's about knowing that everything happens for a reason. So instead of waiting around, waiting for things to happen, take back your power. And this beautiful kind of bouquet of daisies or these flowers here is about new beginnings and rebirth. And the cup is also about nourishment and giving to yourself love. So let's get a message today from this love your inner goddess deck, this, these cards. What do we need to know? What do we need to know? So I've got two cards coming out. So the first one is black diamond. Wow. It says take love. It says true love, the same take love. It says true love is eternal, which it is. So your love is eternal even in the dark times. But take love. Take the love that's been offered to you and given to you everywhere you're receiving it from. Because love comes in many forms, in many ways, in many shapes and sizes. So we receive love always. There's an opportunity every day to receive love. You know, we may think that that love can just come from our twin flame, but it doesn't. It comes from nature. It comes from a smile from a stranger. It comes from the love of your family, friends, children, strangers in the street, someone being good to you, giving you a kind word of advice or being there when you need them. Love can be like me when, you know, you go into a cubicle of a loo and on the back of the door it says you are loved. When we see signs and synchronicities, that's love. So you're being shown today and reminded that in the dark times, when we go through those struggles and that pain, we're given all the love that we can ever need. And we can never crave anything from our twin when we're giving things to ourselves because there's nothing to crave because we feel complete. And we remember here that this love is true love and it's eternal, it's forever, it goes on. And this is about you guys coming together and the magic and the power of the love. And the diamond is reminding you of your power, that you are unique and special and magical and powerful. And the number is 39, have faith in your spiritual power, have faith in your eternal love, you know, have faith in your sacred union because that's where the power is. 
and I love this we've got Finch spirit guide so you know they're giving me the poppy there too which is about power in the mind dreams connecting but also finches are connected with you know communication birds and I feel we're seeing winged creatures right now you know, like butterflies, dragonflies, the bees, birds, angels. You know, we're seeing winged creatures. We're even seeing winged horses. You know, horses with wings, unicorns, things that fly. Because balloons, you know, we've been seeing balloons. Because things that fly in the sky. Because that's about lifting up and raising the vibration. And the Finch Spirit Guide is also bringing in that number 1111 which we've been seeing constantly about awakening and power. It says, I love us. I love us. And I love us. You know, I love you and our connection, the way we share things, the way we're there for each other. I love us. I love me and George. I love us. I love me and you, us. I love my connection with God and Jesus and the angels, us. So love today. So really the message is today, every day is a new opportunity. Every day is an opportunity to begin again and love, to notice love, to be aware of love, to feel love, to operate in the energy of love and choose to make this day a great one. And it will be. This could be the day when your miracle comes in. And every day when we're open to it, we receive miracles. We receive miracles anyway. You know, I've been watching Anne with Green Gables, Anne with an E. Anna Green Gables and the amount of signs in that blows my mind. Foxes and, you know, just amazing things. Even the things they're saying to each other and the way they are being. It's just power. The universe speaks to us in amazing, powerful ways. We just have to be open to it to see. So have a great day today. Remember, today is a new day. It's a day of opportunities, power and love. All you have to do is be open to receiving it and noticing it. And the universe will bless you beyond measure and blow you away. I hope that helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon. And if you're loving this wig, ladies, this is a cheap one from Amazon. I think it was 20 quid. And again, another long one. I cut it shorter. The bangs were down here. I cut the bangs on it and customised it how I wanted it to be. Because I just love, as you guys know, red hair. And I love this kind of really pretty kind of strawberry blonde type red and it's just so gorgeous you know you may call this ginger but I don't see it that way I see it like a gorgeous you know just gorgeous kind of colour of autumn you know autumn leaves it's beautiful and you know this also reminds me of Anne with an E because I've been watching her and really connecting with her power and I just love this today and I know it's got a chunky bang but I love it I love it. I love how it shapes my face. I love the colour. And I love how I've got it matching my top. So again, you know, been wearing the Godiva's wigs, but there's that little bit of creativity that's calling to me to cut and style and make it my own. And that's what I've done with this one. So hope you like this one. Put a bit of colour and brightness into your day. Have a great day. Sending you so much love and I'll see you soon.